Hey guys! Oh my ah, God. awesome. There we go. All right, pull yeah, it. Get inside. Get inside. Get it inside. You can actually see some, oh, there's some stuff swimming around in there right now. Scientist John C. finds that his computer skills aren't the only asset he brings to the colony. We'll start with a 55-gallon drum, and then we'll put a layer of sand, we'll put a layer of charcoal, we'll put a layer of sand, several layers. His understanding of water filtration could be the key to a safe water supply. The plan is to clean the water in three stages. First, a layer of sand sifts out large impurities, such as rocks and algae. Then, a highly porous layer of charcoal traps smaller impurities, such as lead and E. coli. The final step is boiling out any remaining bacteria. Then, they'll have safe, filtered drinking water. Using sand and charcoal they find in the yard, the colonists get to work. One of those, and then we are going to have the, the proof point. This is huge. This is a very special moment. Guys, I want to, I want to tell you something. I have a, had a son, uh, Sam, who was 14 years old, who uh, was killed in a, a traffic accident. He uh, was hit by a car while crossing the street. Soon after his death, we started making these stones. They're just simple, made out of clay, and they have his name written in them. Was, we were just thinking about giving this a test. We figured, well, what can we do to make the water taste better? So I'm gonna stick one of these in there uh, for Sam. All right there, Sam. Let's get that, help us make that water good. All right, let's do this. All right. <laughs> oh, it is, listen to it. I just can't wait till everything's filtered. Now we have water, great. I knew you guys were so water. smart. I love it. <laughs> Next on the colony. We got fire! Fire! The first night. I'm scared how long this is gonna last. And the first intruder. <laughs> the 10 week experiment at the colony has begun. A group of volunteers are living in an abandoned factory with no electricity and no running water as they try to rebuild after a disaster. In their first few hours, they've explored their new home and built a functioning water filter. Matches and fuel. As the first night falls, the worn out colonists turn to other basic needs. Come and warm your wet socks. After marching eight miles in the water. Mmm, listen to that crispy sock burn. That's like dinner. You guys be careful with your bare feet. With their shoes wet and their socks on the grill, the colonists need protection for their feet. I think these are shipping envelopes for something that's somewhat fragile. You guys, we found some kind of sock stuff. And we're going to improvise a little. And what do you think? I'm just just experimenting here. I can tell you, I love your brain. Well, don't say yeah. Thing you choose. Oh, it just feels so good to have dry feet. They feel like I'm walking on air. Oh, really? Yeah. So you might want to do that. Be a little careful because they're not. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't think they're glass or nail proof. Fabulous. Meats, vegetables. Bon appetit. Dinner is served. <laughs> Chicken Vienna sausage. It tastes like 